Voters will head back to the polls again in a few months to cast their ballots on local issues. And a big race in the city of Round Rock is the open seat for mayor. KXN's Lauren Kravitz spoke to both candidates, one of whom is still in high school. Round Rock City Hall is a building unfamiliar to Josh Couture. When you get off the elevator, take a left and go through the glass door. Thank you very much. But he hopes to change that. I'm going to get your signature right here. Josh is filing to run for Round Rock Mayor. I'm just giddy right now. Right before he heads to Cedar Ridge High School, where he's a senior. I got statistics class. Couture is just 18 years old. I just want to change the way people view politics and the way people view their government. I want there to be kind of an open door philosophy with the government that it, uh, it's transparent. People need to feel like that they're making the decisions. But Couture has some competition. Mayor Pro Tem Craig Morgan. That's what's good about democracy. Anybody can run for office, and uh, I'm, I look forward to a good, clean race. And uh, we'll focus on my campaign and my issues. And I think experience uh, really is important in this race. It's not clear how the race is going to turn out just yet, but a contested race in Williamson County costs between fifty and sixty thousand dollars, and that's taxpayer money. If only one candidate filed, the city could cancel the election. Couture thinks he has a chance and doubters motivate him more. I'm very ambitious. I'm very determined. I'm spry. I'm youthful. I'm very prepared to learn as much as I can. But that's up to voters. Thank you very much. Lauren Kravitz, KXAN News. Round Rock's election will be held May the 6th. If Couture wins, he says he will talk to families and businesses about their priorities, for example, lower property taxes. If Morgan is elected mayor, he says he'll focus on transportation, community safety, and quality of life issues like jobs, services, and good parks. We wanted to know a little bit more about the two candidates running for mayor of Round Rock. Craig Morgan is serving as mayor pro tem. He has been on the city council now for six years. Morgan also serves on the St. David's Round Rock Medical Center Board of Trustees and the Round Rock Council Advisory Committee for ACC. He's married with one son who attends the University of Texas at Austin. As Lauren mentioned, Josh Couture is a senior at Cedar Ridge High School and is a member of the National Honor Society. He plans to attend UT Austin and major in government. He also worked the polls during the November election. While we have not seen many young candidates run for mayor, many have run for city council seats. This past November, 19-year-old UT sophomore uh, Victor Toe ran for Pflugerville City Council, place two. The vacant seat went to Jeff Marsh after he won a runoff election. 23-year-old Nicholas Verden ran for Austin City Council, District 10, as you might remember. Allison Alter beat incumbent Sherry Gallo for that seat in a runoff election. And in 2011, then 23-year-old Texas State student Nicholas Kubitis ran for San Marcos City Council but did not win that seat. In Austin, the youngest person to be elected to the city council is actually current council member Greg Kassar. He was first elected to District 4 in 2014 when he was just 25. February.